Hey guys, it's Sierra and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be recreating some iconic celebrity photo shoots. So I had this idea a few weeks ago. I posted on Instagram and asked you guys what celebrity photos you'd want to see me recreate. And I took my three favorites from that and we are going to be recreating them today. So make sure you're following me on Instagram so you can participate in videos like this in the future. Also, before we get into it, I just want to say that I'm not trying to look like these celebrities. I'm just recreating the pose, the outfit, Outfit, the photo shoot. It's just gonna be me, Sierra, in the way I naturally am, but in that celebrity's photo shoot. So let's get into it. So we have like a whole crew today, like making this shoot happen. This is not something I would be able to do on my own. So uh, let's go meet the team and talk about the first outfit I'm recreating. Hi guys, I'm Ruben. Uh, I am the videographer and I've been in a couple of Sierra's BTS if you've seen me. So today I'll be just following Sierra. I'll be quiet, you won't see me anymore, bye. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, uh, my name is Tony Mo, and uh, today I'll be the photographer. So we're doing a few different looks here today, um, but yeah. I'll be uh, shooting and editing, and we're gonna try to recreate um, these looks as closely as possible, but, but with Sierra. Hey guys, I'm Skylar. You may know me if you watch all of Sierra's other videos. Uh, today I'm helping with the costumes and sets, and just making sure everything runs smoothly. Hey guys, this is Stephanie. I am Sierra's makeup artist. I'm just over here getting everything set up, from my makeup to my skincare. We're doing three different looks today and I'm super excited. So the first outfit I'm gonna be doing is this iconic Britney Spears black lingerie sexy photo shoot. Definitely a little bit more scandalous than I would usually go for my Instagram photos, but uh, we're gonna be pushing some of my boundaries today for sure. So I've got this black lacy bodysuit on and a like black bustier bra underneath, and then I've got some pajama shorts too because uh, all you're gonna be seeing in the photo is like waist up, so why not be comfortable? So let's go get into hair and makeup with Stephanie and uh, make all the magic happen. Okay, here is the makeup look. I have never had like this dark, like sultry, sexy makeup and I'm like kind of feeling myself in it. Like I feel like it's a little, like the whole thing is like definitely a little out of my comfort zone. It's Britney, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so Britney actually has highlighter on her arms and her chest. So Stephanie's gonna highlight me there. I'm doing everything. Also like her armpits are so smooth in that photo. It has to be Photoshop because they are like perfectly smooth. I got some stubble going on, but I, I think we're just gonna leave it as is, you know? It's, it's me, I'm recreating the photo, making it more natural, more Sierra, I guess, and Sierra has armpit stubble, so that's what we're going with. You know, I think going into this look, I was definitely a little nervous because it's, it's a lot on the makeup and it's also like, a little in the clothes, which is like, usually those are flipped for me. But I feel like, you know, I have to just kind of embrace the body that I have. And even if I don't look like Britney, I look like me. And I'd rather look like me recreating her look than try to look exactly like Britney Spears. So you look like a Victoria's Secret model. Thank you, except <laughs> apparently they don't work with anyone who's not a size two, oh so. No tea, no shade, just facts. <laughs> okay, so for a lot of the other outfits, we're taking the photos on like a paper roll or this white backdrop or the black, but but for this specific Britney Spears photo, the backdrop is like textured and the wall of the studio actually has some like wire on it. So I think we're gonna take it over there. Tony set up like a little mini studio within the studio and we're gonna make it happen. Yeah. yeah. Which hand? Switch the hands switch though the hands. like that. Make it a little bit, little bit softer, more relaxed. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. But no. her weight isn't shifted, right? It's no. like right in the middle. Okay. Right in the middle and that, I, think, I think chin down like that. Per yeah. Perfect. Yeah. 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 Let's do it. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Who? That is oh, not me. That is you, girl. That is That's oh absolutely you. Oh. Brittany can do it. You can do it. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh! That, that is, is queen. So Look at this queen here. Good. I'm gag. But this is more of a smirk here, whereas Brittany, she's more like, like more dead like, on. Yeah, like I'm gonna do this. Like okay. I'm gonna yeah. hop on that. And her, I think her <laughs> eyes are a little bit more squinted. It seems yes, like a little yeah. bit more. A little more tension in it yeah. right there. I'm really bad at sexy face. Like I literally can't do sexy face. I always just do like smiley at all my Instagram pictures. <laughs> so this is gonna be a little bit more of a challenge. You can do it. I, I'm yeah. gonna try. I feel, yeah. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Be a, little, a little more tension in the eyes right there. There, exactly that, that's exactly it. Now chin just a little bit more straight on this way over here. There you go. Awesome, 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 awesome. Nice. <laughs> I feel like the 
longer you look at the Britney Spears photo, the weirder her arms look. Right? I, this looks, looks like, like a real photo. So <laughs> oh, like, I like this so much more, honestly. I'm sorry, Britney. Yeah. I love Thank you, girl. Thank you. But this is a much more realistic uh, woman here. I mean, it, yeah. feels, it feels honest. It really yeah, does. I, I think that's really why I wanted to do this video is like, you can still look like glamorous yeah. and you can still look like freaking Britney Spears, but you don't have to have the typical like Hollywood body. Like, I think this is a beautiful picture. I think Britney Spears picture is beautiful too, Fantastic. but yeah, it's just different bodies. I, I agree, I agree. I love this so much. Okay, so I'm filming this like a week after the photo shoot portion. The photos are in, I'm so excited. So let's take a look at the final product, me and Britney Spears. Tony edited the colors of this photo to try to match Britney's colors, but no other retouching was done. We left my armpits all stubbly. We left some of the bumps and imperfections on my skin. And I just love this photo. I would never have done a photo shoot like this outside of a video. Like the lingerie, the dark makeup, it's definitely Definitely a little bit more sultry than my typical look, but I really, really like it. I think Britney looks beautiful, but I think I also look beautiful in my photo, even though our bodies are completely different. There's more than one type of sexy. That's all I have to say for this one. Okay, so Stephanie is just finishing up the last touches on the hair. She transformed my makeup. I've got this gown, the gloves, the necklace. I'm pretty sure based on all of this, you guys can probably guess which photo I'm gonna be recreating. Leave your guess in the comments. Drum roll! It's Kim Kardashian. Break the internet for Paper Magazine where she's got the champagne glass on her butt. Uh, yeah, so that is the last thing that we're gonna have to add on. Um, I do not have a Kim Kardashian butt. Like, I have a butt, but not a Kim Kardashian butt. Not a big enough platform to balance a champagne glass on, that's for sure. <laughs> so, our plan is Skylar hot glued a champagne glass to a piece of fabric that's similar to this dress, and then we're gonna try to safety pin that fabric right on to my butt so that when I do the pose, I have no idea how I'm gonna do the pose, but when I do it, there will be a champagne glass and it will look like it's balancing there even though it's really hot glued. So let's give a little pan of this dress. Uh, I really don't have a lot of events where I have to dress like red carpet, black tie. So I'm kind of really enjoying this. And I never wear my hair up. I mean, you guys watch my videos. My hair is always down. Literally, I only put my hair up if I'm going to the gym. So doing like a fancy updo is so different for me, but it's really cool to like see myself in a bunch of different looks and different styles. And this is definitely glamorous. I'm excited to try it. Let's do it. Kind of bend over like how you're going to. I'm gonna straighten this out. This is so funny, sorry. <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorite shoes I've done each really? this year. Oh, Yay. so, yeah, absolutely, it's so oh, much fun. This is, gonna be, this yeah. is gonna be a good one. So we're not actually gonna have to open this champagne bottle because Tony is going to Photoshop in the like stream, obviously. <laughs> that is the only Photoshop that's gonna be used in this. We're leaving my tummy, we're leaving my arms, we're leaving the stubble, everything else, but you know, Champagne, that's gonna need some editing magic. <laughs> I wonder how they actually did this in the shoe. Like, did they, they must have like glued it or something to her butt. I feel like they might have um, did it in pose. You think I, so? I, I, yeah, I, I mean, they could have glued it, Yeah. but I feel like it was definitely in pose. Yeah? I feel like her ass was definitely retouched too. <laughs> <laughs> Tony knows everything about editing, so. So. If he says it was done in post, it was done in post, but we're not gonna fix my ass in the post. <laughs> we're just oh. gonna leave it the way it is. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got the champagne glass. It is uh, safety pinned to my butt. Now we just have to figure out how to do this pose because it is very like contorted. We're gonna have you arch your back, arch. stick the butt out, and then shoulders back. There you go. Now let me make this so there's no gap <laughs> Arch that back, girl. There we go. And then bring the chin, chin straight on over here. Wonderful. I think you're gonna have to stand straighter. Yeah. I think that's the... That's gonna be the only way, but the thing is, though, is that... That glass has to... <laughs> the glass is gonna be, like, like sticking out. Yeah. That is... That is, is impossible. That, that is not real. That's not there's real. Not. I'm sorry, there's no way <laughs> for any of us in this room to do that. Because I think it's less about having a big butt and having a butt that, like, the champagne glass can rest, rest on. Rest on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so squat. Yeah. Squat that right here. And then, like, back up. There you go. That's that it. Yeah, that's perfect. And then... Okay, so the champagne glass fell off. Skylar's repinning it, and then we're gonna try a second time. <laughs> that's actually pretty darn perfect. Okay. okay. All right, awesome. Okay, keep it. Nice. Okay, so I, I just don't under... Okay, 
The glass must be superimposed. Has, has because it's it's like perfectly straight. There's no way. Mm. That's oh you yeah, can literally you see, see it. it too. <laughs> Wow. Okay, well, <laughs> we're making this more real than Kim did, because we got a real glass on my butt. <laughs> okay. So, awesome. so one more round? One more round. Yeah, oh, let's do it. one more round. Great. Okay, ready? Yep, ready. Cute. <laughs> Big smile. Great, 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 great. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, Kim Kardashian. I may not be able to break the internet with this photo, but I think I can at least slow down the Wi-Fi a little bit. Okay, sorry for the bad internet pun, but I really like this photo. At first when I saw it, I was a little bit self-conscious about, you know, the way my stomach looks, especially when comparing it to Kim Kardashian, but there's nothing wrong with having a little bit of a stomach. I definitely do in this photo, and I definitely do in real life, and there's nothing about that that makes me less beautiful. It just makes my body more unique. Also, I definitely had my suspicions, but I wasn't gonna be the one to accuse this photo of being photoshopped, but Tony is pretty much a Photoshop and retouching expert. I mean, that's what he does for a living. And he seems pretty confident that that little arch on Kim's back and her butt was definitely uh, touched up a little bit in post. And after actually recreating this photo and doing that pose, I definitely would agree with Tony. I think that curve on Kim's back in the photo is beautiful, but it just doesn't look quite real. But either way, I think that Kim Kardashian photo is iconic and I had a blast recreating it. And I really, I really like this photo. I think I'm gonna post it on Instagram. Okay, so we are right in the middle of hair and makeup for our third and final celebrity photo. That is the iconic Marilyn Monroe fan blowing up the skirt look. I'm excited for this one. It is gonna be so different from the first two, like the hair, the makeup, the outfit, the pose, everything. So we are gonna have to cut some corners for this hair because doing little pin curls like this takes forever. Has so much hair too. So much hair. My hair is so thick. So we're gonna leave party in the back. Like this. We're just gonna do a little ponytail in the back and you won't be able to tell in the photo, but you guys will, you guys get to see the behind the scenes. It's like Billy Ray Cyrus. Yeah, business in the front, party in the back. <laughs> also, we need two extras for this photo because there are two like paparazzis posing in the background. So Skylar over here is oh, in her costume. Put on my glasses. I've transformed into the man version of myself. <laughs> I told Sierra I look like Michael Weiss. From Tanacon? <laughs> you just need a segue. <laughs> you can't even tell at all from the front. That is so like, funny. You cannot tell that this little pigtail <laughs> in the back. And then in this glam is in the front. I feel like a vintage like pinup girl. You're like um an like in real life American girl doll. <gasps> Oh, my childhood dreams <laughs> coming true. Your kids. All right, we've got this 50s hair and makeup. I am really excited for this one, and it's the first photo we're doing in black and white, which I feel like will make it easier in some ways because we didn't have to be so exact with like the lip color and, and that kind of thing. But it's also gonna be a difficult photo because we are using an industrial fan to get that blown up skirt look. So it's not just gonna be like hitting one pose like it was for the Kim Kardashian photo, or the Britney Spears photo. Like we're really gonna have to work to get this pose right. And I'm gonna be in heels, which uh, I cannot stand or walk or function in heels. <laughs> I'm excited though. I feel like of the photos I've recreated so far, Marilyn Monroe is definitely the most similar to my body type. Like I feel like her body structure is more similar to mine than like Kim Kardashian. And I don't think there was Photoshop back then. Tony? No. No Photoshop. Not. So we can just work with what I've got naturally here and not have to keep up with someone who's doing a lot of editing. And we're gonna have Stephanie and Skylar in the back as our extras. The fan is gonna be super, super loud, so let's get into a montage. <laughs> Effort. I mean, look at look at you. You look so that good. Is everything. <laughs> I'm a fan. Okay, so that was the last photo we're shooting. Let's let Tony work his magic, edit this photo, and see how it all came together. 
So let's take a look at our last photo, me and Marilyn Monroe. Now this actually, I think this is my favorite photo from this video. I just feel like it's classic, it's iconic, it's very, you know, retro Hollywood and having the fan blow up my skirt at just the right angle. It feels so like glamorous. I think that's the word I'm looking for. Like I've never felt as glamorous as I do in this Marilyn Monroe photo. Also Marilyn is like the original curvy icon. So getting to recreate a photo that's actually more similar to my body type and my body structure definitely boosted my confidence. And I just wish we had more celebrities like Marilyn today who have like a wider range of body types and structures. She's an icon, she's the OG curvy queen and recreating this photo totally made me feel like a movie star. I am so glad that I decided to do this video. It was a blast and a huge thank you to the whole team who made this possible. And let me know in the comments which photo was your favorite and I do have a part two planned. So if this video gets to 8,000 likes, I will post part two this month. So make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you liked this video, subscribe for more fashion, body positivity content like this. I make new videos every Tuesday and Friday and I would love to have you join the family. And if you're new, make sure to sound off in the comments so I can welcome you to the family. Thanks so much for watching. Be confident, love your curves, and I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Bye!